Hi, and welcome back to our Technical Analysis Edition. My name is Violeta Todorova, and I'm Senior Research Analyst at Leverage Shares. The Federal Reserve raised its policy rate by another 75 basis points last week to a range of 3 and 3.25% at the conclusion of its two days meeting of the Federal Market Committee. The fund forecasts another 125 basis points of hikes by year end, which implies that the policy rate will reach 4.4% and terminal rate possibly above the widely expected 4.6% next year, aiming to bring inflation down to the Fed's target rate of 2%. This means that monetary policy will remain restrictive over the next few years and the Fed reduced its growth forecast for 2022 to 2024. The Fed expects to ease rates to 3.9% in 2024 and fall to 2.9% in 2025. The Federal Reserve is aiming to restore price stability despite the risk that it will drive unemployment higher and tip the weakening economy into a recession. Since reaching a record high on January 5, the blue chip benchmark has lost more than 21%, consistently forming lower lows and lower highs, and is currently trading at its lowest level in two years. The index was hard hit, and the latest downswing has started on August 17, as recession fears are rising. The selling pressure has intensified over the past week as outlook remains bleak and investors are bracing for the worst earnings season in two years. Trillions of dollars have been wiped off the value of the index and all three major US indices have fallen more than 20% since the onset of the year. The daily and weekly charts are as bearish as they could possibly be with the recent breakout below the June low maintaining the sequence of lower lows and lower highs, which adheres to the standard definition of a bear market. As Federal Reserve policymakers are hinting for more, more rate hikes, at the risk of pushing the economy into a downturn, we see a good probability of the market declining to 26,400 points over the medium term. The weekly RSI indicator is very weak and supports our view that the market has further to fall before hitting a bottom. On Wednesday, the daily RSI indicator has turned up from oversold levels, pointing to a likely short-term rebound. The current state of the market suggests that the potential upcoming bounce is likely to be short-lived. Given we are entering the seasonally weak month of October, a major bounce is unlikely. Therefore, we believe that the potential short-term rebound is likely to be arrested around 31,300 points. Overall, the technical and fundamental backdrop suggests investors should brace for more volatility and weakness in the coming months. Thank you very much for tuning in. See you next time.